Artists in the mission are trying to cope with some bad news. The warehouse they've been using is being put up for sale, and the artists have been told to leave. The KPIX 5's Reed Cowan met the artists who are packing up and moving out. Dear tenants. Dear tenants. This letter is to inform you that 931 and 933 Treat Avenue, San Francisco, California, has been listed for sale. This letter will serve as notice to all tenants to kindly vacate September 30th, 2022, so that we can prepare the property for sale. It was the letter the artist of Heinzer Warehouse knew was coming. Owner Ernie Heinzer's death put the property into an estate, now choosing to cash in. And the artists who have created there for decades are... Slowly been packing up. We, I mean, I've personally looked at probably 20, 20 spaces so far, and... Uh, I don't want to move into a single one of them. Daniel Chen is one of several artists counting down to move out day. The, my birthday is the day I'm supposed to be out, so it should be a good one. Oh, it's, it's hard to feel like I have a place here as an artist in San Francisco. Makes all the bad stuff about living here a little more visible, so. <laughs> That's John Stitch putting the finishing touches on the last painting he will paint here. Genevieve, are you in? Uh, yes, I'm here. Same with etch artist Genevieve. She wants the city to enact policy changes that help artists have affordable places to create. And right now, it's going into a mono, you know, singular, high-end residential usage. And if, if the city doesn't care about that, then that's what's happening. As for Daniel, his last painting here has to be sold. Uh, hopefully, I... I'm able to finish this today, have it dry up, and I can send it over and make some money so I can afford to move out of the studio. The next studio I move to, I, you know, I don't, I don't want to move for probably another 10 years or forever. With the artist at Treat and 22nd. I, I want a home. Reed Cowan, KPIX 5. The trust that now owns the warehouse is offering relocation help to the artists. Turns out the former owner loved artists and wanted them to have help.